Let's talk about blood pressure, mean arterial pressure, vasopressors and inotropes. Blood pressure is directly proportional to mean arterial pressure. As a patient's blood pressure increases, you could safely estimate that their mean arterial pressure also increases. The relationship between these two is as follows. In general, you want to maintain an adequate mean arterial pressure to prevent organ or tissue death. Pure vasopressors, or the drugs that work to cause vasoconstriction, maintain a mean arterial pressure, mostly by augmenting vascular resistance. When a blood vessel constricts, its diameter or radius becomes smaller, and as a result, vascular resistance increases. So what pure vasopressors actually do is that they clamp down on our vessels, causing a decrease in the diameter of the vessel. By doing this, you increase resistance, causing an increase in blood pressure and mean arterial pressure. Taking this just a step further, vascular resistance is not the only thing that contributes to mean arterial pressure. Cardiac output also plays a crucial role in that mean arterial pressure is equal to cardiac output multiplied by the total peripheral resistance. So by increasing either of these, you could also increase your mean arterial pressure. This is essentially how your vasopressors and inotropes will be working. <laughs>